Hey folks, Quill18 here, and welcome to another episode of the Sunni Strike Back with Magic we do. and Shin... What? We do. We do. We do strike back. Yeah, strike harder. Nothing with your intro. Sunni Strike Back 3, The Vengeance of the Iberian Peninsula. The Re-Re-Conquista. Or is the it just the Conquista? Conquista. The anyway. Conquista, round two. These other guys are Magin and Shinner. <laughs> these are, now that Shen's completely messed up your intro. <laughs> Like, yeah, these people over there. But my flow! Hi, <laughs> my flow. My flow. How was your flow? Wait, don't answer. <laughs> uh, it's very so satisfying. News. Too good much news. coffee. As, as much as uh, Treyarch's trying to hide in Austria, uh, Austria's got a 43 stack about to hit them. Yay. All right, I'm ready to go when you are. Okay, we're going. Cool. Cool, cool, And cool. goodbye stack. I'm just wondering if we should declare war on Austria before we actually finish this war. I found out about Saskatchewan. That's not a real place. What? You didn't know about Saskatchewan? Nah, it's a myth. That's oh a my cool god, place I'm gonna have to attack now. Yep, don't lose it. Frack, let's go. All right, Siena's been freed. Across. Well, okay, it's still sieged, but... Hey, guy, what you doing? Oh. Hey, guy, where are you on... Get in there. My coring place! It's at 99.6. Okay. Stupid been fine. Savoy. I have ungrateful natives. I'm just trying to educate them. <laughs> Why can't you be grateful? Oh yeah, I can't declare war in Austria while we're already at war with Trier, right? Derp -de -derp. Oh no, I can! Hey. Why can you? Oh, because he's not in the war. No, but you're not... Oh yeah, I guess, maybe, but no. Haven't it's we had specifically this specifically because you, you're not at war with the Emperor. Oh yeah, yeah, if you're at war with the Emperor, you can't be at war with somebody lesser than the Emperor. But if you're not at war with the Emperor, you can be at war with the Emperor later. Or something. Oh, hey, you're killing Savoy's navy. Yay! Yep. Well, uh, you know, no longer Just have Moroccan any... things. You don't have any Catholic zealots Just anymore, Moroccan so... Things. Yeah, thank you. Ah. I'm going to go de-siege Siena. Yeah, I figured I'd kill the rebels and you could deal with the rest. Actually, I guess I could probably just dock with all these. There's no hey. more enemy naval stuff now. Oh, trade dispute with France, so that's a thing again. Oh. I've recently um, idea bulled um, three different things that would give me plus 75% manpower. It's just amazing. <laughs> wow. Like total or not 75 each? Total, total. Yeah. My next my next innovative idea is optimism. Nice. Almost there. Well, things are really looking up then. I should have got this like beginning of the game. For everything else, innovative. You know how many Diplo points I've wasted on... Multiple relationships? No. Oh, no, wait, no. Um, uh, what's reducing, yeah, reducing war exhaustion. Right. Oh, no! 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 Regency. Uh -huh. For how long? Uh, Ten years. Oh, that I is can't a long time. I cannot declare war in Austria. Oh, you had a plot. Can Quill declare on Austria? Oh, yeah, I'm sure he can. You yeah. take the stab hit. Oh, I have a border with Austria in Ruppen. Let me go get a claim. Yeah, okay. You do that. Nice. Although he is allied to France and Castile. Wow. That's fine. What could go wrong? Sounds less than fine, actually. All good. We have a peace with uh, Castile anyways, right? Yes. For a while. Yeah. No, no, France is embargoing me. Yeah, what's France got? Uh, let's see, who's got the big force, or total forces? Uh, it's me, then you, then Great Britain, then Morocco, then Austria, then France. So Yeah, Britain has a surprising amount of units. Yeah. 
Our army isn't too grand. Damn it. Your army sucks? What? Oh, jeez, Quill, your manpower. Oh, yeah. <laughs> like that, I said before, my army is like 90% mercs from the last war, and it's not like we had a chance to have that bounce back. Uh, mine bounced back. I'm at 117,000. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> like, I'm at 117,000. I'm good. Oh, oh, hey, uh, even though you're in a regency, can you claim Crimea's throne? He's claimable. He's got but I weak can't air. declare war, though. Why is there so much attrition here? No, fully defensive. He's not, and he's not even of my uh, dynasty oh, you anymore. Do, you guys don't even have a marriage. Nope. That all went away a little while ago. Can you get the marriage back? Nope. They hate me. God damn it, Crimea. What I like about this war is I never had to bring my uh, my trade ships no, in. No! Stupid Persia showed up late. Showed up late to a fight. Made me lose. Punks. Alright, since I'm going to be in a regency for a bit. And it looks like everybody's happily sieging stuff all by themselves. Who? Oh, I don't care about that. It wasn't me. Yeah, we're going to find a new way to declare war on people. Ten years of regency is not a good plan. Uh, yeah, by the way, we're at 99% in this war. I had noticed. Wow, that was quick. Yeah. God, why do we have a minus a 50 insulted with a Granada? When did that happen? Hmm. Uh, I don't know. Maybe somebody was dumb and insulted their vessel. No. I don't know. The vassals are dumb enough. They shouldn't have noticed. Oh, my yep. God. I finally had an heir, and he's really good, and there's no way he's going to live long enough to escape Regency. Yeah. Damn it. Well, you can and he has strong claim up. too. Sure. Yeah, <laughs> just soak it up. Let him. Let him be a regent. You when can't. It's... Yes, you can. If you say Courts no child are not can allowed be... to have regencies. No, it'll come up with no child can be a con, and you can say no to that, and what? keep him. Yeah, you can say no. Are you sure? Yeah. That sounds like you don't have you to accept before. it. Uh, okay, I'll take a look. I don't remember that being an option. Yeah, well, normally you're like, okay, no kid, but um, it's going to come with revolt and revolters. But you can pretty much tell them all to go away. Kill them. Um, so I guess the question for the day is, what are we doing up here? Yeah, uh, can I piece out separately? I don't know, can you? I think I can. Yeah, you should. Oh, these are awkward occupations of Savoy. Mm -hmm. But I could at yeah. least grab Nice. What's my overextension right now? Still high. I'll, I'll be going over my limits, but... Uh, for quite some time, actually. Hmm. Oh, I can the... probably... No, I can't Cuneo's sell. Cuneo's the important province, because if we can get that and Dauphine and Languedoc, we can walk to Spain. Yeah, but that's mm -hmm. occupied by the Ottomans. Yeah. So I can get Nice, and I can get Wallace. Can you get Holland? Can it? Oh, it's not soon for a piece. Can, Actually, can I you, get Holland? Can you uh, vassal Savoy? Why can? Where's, how, why where's can Savoy I get in? Holland? Oh, occupied by me. One of my dudes must have walked up there. Yeah. Um, I cannot. I don't have enough stuff. I forgot about that. I don't have enough war score for any. Oh, what's your war score? It's only fourteen percent. Oh, okay. Ow. Yeah, I can't directly ask for anything. If I got six more or eight more, I could get Wallace. Okay. Well, click the button to let me. Uh... Do this for you. for you. Done. Okay. Let's see what we can really get. Because uh, Savoy's completely soaked. Mm -hmm. So, no, it's 148% for a Moroccan vassal. So, close, but not quite. Uh, right now, we're giving back some, a core to um, Bavaria. So, we need Nice. Yes. We need Nice. Uh, it would be nice. Yep. So we'll give you Nice. Uh, so we can at least get closer to Provence. Not sure about Wallace. We should probably wait on that. 
Yeah, and there's really is a limit to how much overextension I can really soak. Well, I guess should if soak. you're over a hundred, it doesn't really matter. And either <laughs> way. Yeah. Um well right now, weirdly, uh if I give Bavaria back their two cores, one of which they actually sieged, and give you Nice, that's ninety nine percent. Alrighty then. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> like, this was a really crappy war to start. But um, do you want to let me finish claiming Austria before you peace out? Oh, yeah, yeah. I also have to move my troops out of there. Otherwise, they'll get caught. Um. So, yeah, I guess that's the peace deal. Unless we want to kill Tuscany. But no. I think uh, getting the Nice and oh, the Bavarian Oh, our truce with are... Castile will end real soon. Do you want them no, in is, that war or not? Isn't it two years? Might as well have Castile in that war, right? Peace them out separately. Um, My truce with Castile is 1652. Yeah, you peaced out early, dude. Oh, I peaced out early. You're right. But yeah, yeah. Okay, we'll wait. Yeah, we're good. Oh, no. My general died. Oh, no. I'm stacking Google's myself. westernized. Completely? Yep. Well, that should be amusing. Mm -hmm. There are only two techs behind you. Yep. Oh, wait. Hold on. Everybody back together. Yay! Cairo is part of the patrimony. So, Pisa is the only thing left. Okay, are you ready? Yeah, keep watching that. Are you ready? To rock? Maybe. Because uh, it's 1651. Holy yeah. War is off the list of things to do. Yep. Sadly. Sadly. Yep. All right. Uh, so before we let the timer go, um, are we done? Yeah. Well, you ready to start a war against Austria? Is that it? I need a claim. It's oh, fabricating. Yeah. How far away are you? Always. Oh. Always. All right. Then I guess we peace. Okay. Or is there? Did we want to keep this war going until we declared in Austria? Is that the idea? Um, well, there's no real point because I don't think it makes much of a difference. Yeah, it's Austrian allies. That doesn't really matter. Okay. Might as well uh, peace out then. Yeah. I really hate that Regency Council. <laughs> About time for a coalition war, don't you think? Uh, it's been five minutes. There. Yep. <laughs> All right. So Bavaria, Bavaria, and some Moroccan. I will take a little cash too, just because. Poof. All right. Let's move in there. Move in there. The Bavarians are getting bigger. And there's no way that Milan wants this, does it? <laughs> Savoy left left the coalition against me. So what was the peace deal? Uh, Bavaria got uh, two quarters back, and um, Quill got uh, Nice. Oh, neat. Okay. No, I guess I'll take it. Ah. Uh, I guess I'll take a Diplotech. I guess. <laughs> and what are you at now? Yeah, eleven. Eh, why not? All right, gonna do the great merge of the military because it has been a while. Um, I need more cannons, actually. I need a lot more cannons. Kiribati Islands. There's very little Terra Incognita left. Well, there you go. Still haven't seen Hawaii, but other than that. Yeah, and I just took two loans so that I could buy more cannons. Like 50 below my force limit. So I might as well max out. Mm. 
Well, at my force limit. Well, basically. But it's all mercs. Okay, that's 30 more cannons. Yeah, should be okay, but let's go for some from Janissaries. Oh, bad reputation. Well, that's no fun. No, down to 17 People prestige. don't like you. Uh, I should have this new army all prepped and ready to go. It'd be really nice if I could finish coring everything before the next war, but there's no way in hell that's happening. I'd be surprised if any core is finished before the next war. So I'll be going into it with like 120% or 108% overextension. Well, how, which cores, what's your highest core? Uh, 58% in Mercia and Natal, 57% in Andalusia. Okay. As long as you're not at war with Castile, you should be okay. All right. Minus 127. Not so much. <sighs> Minus 90. Not so much. Can I pull in... Can we just, like, fill in Bohemia on this next war? Can we what? Oh, oh what, what happened to Australia? Or Austria. <laughs> <laughs> Good eye, mate. Wow. <laughs> what happened to Australia? Um, Austria. What did it soak in? What was here? Just eight... Trier. Mm. Uh, basically, they took Ansbach. And by eight, yeah, I just kind of mean they took Ansbach. You know, just, just for, for shits and giggles, Manchu has military access in Brandenburg. You know, why not? Sure. Why not? Type of relationship. It's fine. Oh, good. I actually have non zero manpower now. Ooh. <laughs> you have Sounds three like fun. Congrats. Optimism! Woohoo! Oh, god damn it. <laughs> it's so bad when I have optimism, huh? No, some rebels popped up right on top of the guys who were trying to de-siege Sienna. Mm. There you go. Milan actually moved some troops there for a change. That's nice. That's a better. Now I'm at 182. Troops? 20. Wow. Yeah. That force limit. Welcome to my force limit. What is your limit? Uh, 184. Ooh, French Canada is improving relations with us. I like it. Uh, what? Why? Why not? If 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 Manchu has military access in Brandenburg, then French Canada can improve relations with Kazan. Why I not? guess it's totally reasonable. Sure, why not? <laughs> Totally reasonable. <sighs> Jerks. Good island. I should culture convert that island. I'm kind of tired of them jumping out. Oh, wow. You know Lithuania what? has got Polish patriot problems. Mm -hmm. That's good. All right. I got my claim on Austria. Do you want me to declare right away or you guys want to get ready? Um, Are they going to bring in Castile? Yes. Uh. Yeah, you know what? Bahrain, not going to be Bedouin for long. Probably 2025 to culture convert it. Any troops there. Oh, by the way, I'm also going to have no manpower shortly. Because <laughs> I moved everything into Constantinople and then forgot about it. <laughs> Oh. All right, um, as for your declaration on Austria, uh, pause, pause, pause. 
Uh, if you declare war on Austria... Go no. on. Yeah, I guess you can call me in right away. Oh, Austria's back up to 99 prestige. Oh, jeez. Did not take them off. It's no. troops. Oh, still still has no manpower. 12k okay. and 38,000 active troops. Building any units still? And it looks like some of their stuff's still getting sieged by rebels or something. Oh, okay. Unless there's a graphic glitch going on. God, France has 80k manpower. Yep, that's fine. I've got 92. Um, all right, so I would say go for it. Declare war. Okay. Let's do this thing. 15 days. Right. All my stuff's in uh, Constantinople, though, so I don't have any insta stack wipe ability. That's fine. All right. Just declare war and you're in your ready. Also dealing yeah, with stupid rebels. Um, I should have, yeah, 1653 August, so a year and a bit, Switzerland will be soaked. Oh, keep in nice. mind, I still have the truce going on. I don't know if it matters with Castile for another few months. No, it well, doesn't matter. Well, we're declaring war on Austria, so as long as you jump in oh, right, before... Right. As long as Castile doesn't jump in. So okay. this is who's going to join. Moldavia, Poland, France, Provence... Aachen, Anhalt, Ulm, Castile, Tuscany, Netherlands, and Hungary. Yeah, I don't think that's much of an issue. Now, would you like the war to be Conquest of Ruppin, where that's going to give us a ticking war score, or do you want Battles to be the war score? Uh, I do with vassals. Conquest. <laughs> conquest too many vassals is safer. and stuff, and definitely Conquest. Yeah. Okay. So just make sure we, we uh, conquer Ruppin early on, get that ticking war score. Okay. And do, do, you want, do you want the calls to be immediate or, or what? Uh, me, you can make it immediate. Probably make it immediate is fine. Okay, well, we'll keep it paused. Is Portugal going to jump in? No. No. And now right. that the Ottomans are in, yep. um, I think that means Castile can't join the war. Well, they might, defensively. They still could. I guess we'll find out. It might keep them away, though. Because it is a defensive war, so. But okay, they've been pause when you're ready. Yeah, because yeah. right now the chart looks good. Oh, there we go. Yep, Castile's in. Okay. Yeah, figured. Which probably means I should bring my trade fleets in. Well, that one's fighting. France is in. Dutch are in. Provence is in. The question is... Actually, since this is not even remotely a coalition war, we sh should be able to piece them all out individually, right? Yes, as long as we all separate siege. Yeah, so, i.e. Morocco. Go back to Castile? Uh, yeah. No, Provence first. Oh, yeah, yeah. Hell, I'm right there. Start there first. Um, and just hope that uh, France doesn't come stacked by you. But, yeah, we'll see what happens. Seems likely that that's exactly what's going to happen. They would never do that. Yeah, okay. I'm going to go into uh, Moldovia just to siege it out to give us war score. And I th I'm probably going to have to run a bunch of units up to uh, roll and area. Oh, Castile's got its big crush. fleet in the Malta Channel. That's interesting. Try that. God, the Teutons have wasted no time converting Finland. <laughs> Go Teutons. You are orderific. All right, stupid rebels. Oh, good. And it looks like Tuscany didn't join. Is that because good? they, well, it's good because it doesn't stop my Pisa core again. Oh, neat. Yeah. Um, you have thirty-five stack coming at you in uh, Provence. Forty-eight stack. Uh huh. And I'm sure they're gonna catch me. 
Nope, you're going to make it. And By one day. Fantastic. And I'm fighting the Gulf of Elnir yet. Kidding me. Yep. That's it. Ah, oh, these episodes, they're so short. At least um... we don't have to wait a week. Not for us, anyway. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I have no naval leader anymore. All right, no. see you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye. Hey, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe. Also, leave a comment. Did you know I read every single comment someone leaves on my video? That's insane. Why would I do that? I don't know, but I'll read yours.